Hi guys. I haven't done this in a while and um, it's been very long. So here I am live for you guys and I have all the time now because we all have a lot of time. So I'm not going to go till you guys get bored, <laughs> which I hope you don't. So let's get started. I see a lot of hearts coming. A lot of highs. Hi guys. Okay, I have to thank my fan clubs. There's Team Rashi. There's Benidar, who's a sweetheart who's been writing uh, stuff for me, who's been making stuff for me. And I want to tell you guys that it ma means a lot to me. There's Java Meme Official. There is Rashi My Heart. There is Rashi Slave. Um, and there's a lot. I'm sorry if I've forgotten any name, but I just want to say that uh, you guys, it means a lot to me that the things that you keep doing and you know the things that you keep. Um, Hi, Saud. <laughs> the things that you keep uh, doing for me. Also, Fan Fridays, uh, the art that I was sharing with you guys, um, that has increased a lot because of the lockdown. I think maybe because you guys are constantly making more stuff. And I just want to tell you that I am watching all of that, uh, but I can't share all of them. Uh, I have seen all of them. So, um, uh, if I've seen them, I'm definitely going to be sharing every Friday as many as I can. I try to. Uh, but thank you so much. Uh, the one that I shared with uh, a scarf on my mouth, I think it's very popular because a lot of you guys have made uh, art on that, which is very sweet. So thank you so much for that. And um, yeah, guys, on about the basic information, I just wanted to ask you, I hope you all are at home. I also hope that uh, you have made... Hi, Karunya, I'm watching your comments. <laughs> Lots of love to you. I have these friends, uh, you know, some of the friends you have, then you don't really need enemies. Those friends. Those friends are online taking my case on live. <laughs> okay, but anyway, yeah. So coming back to the mask, um, I hope you guys uh, have masks at home. And if you don't have masks at home, you can always make one at home. Uh, guys, use make it with a rubber band because if you, uh, say, if you wear a handkerchief or if you wear a dupatta, um, it's not going to be tight. So, so you know, it's not going. It's only going to give you partial, um, uh, partial. Uh, it's going to be a partial saving. So, I hope that you guys have checked out the uh, link that I have shared on my Instagram page. It's very easy to make. You can make it with an old T-shirt. I hope you really don't have to get out. But if you have to have to get out, then please wear a mask and get out. That's the basic thing we can do to save ourselves and others around us. So tell me what you guys have been doing, what are you guys watching? I think I've practically finished a lot of stuff online, on uh, Netflix, OTT platforms, I've seen a lot of stuff already. So why don't you guys suggest me something that I can watch? I love thrillers, I am a thriller fan, huge thriller fan, and anything related to crime I really like. Um, I think there's a hidden cop inside me, <laughs> which comes out in films, and I love watching, watching that on screen. Um, I can suggest you something, some things that I have been watching that I really like. Uh, there is one uh, show called The Dark, which is really nice. It's on Netflix. It's a German series. And um, one, two episodes in it, I think you'll get hooked to it. So that is one thing. Uh, Dark, it's a German show. Watch it, guys. I think you'll really like it if you're into time travel. That's all about time travel. I love time travel. So um, watch that. There's, uh, I've been watching a lot of world cinema. There is um, Mirage, there's a Spanish film, uh, which is really nice. So uh, watch that. Uh, if you get, if you like, um, that, that's also a little about time travel, but it's, it's a thrill. So I hope you like that. Then there is How to Get Away with Murder. I think it's one of my favorite shows uh, ever. Like, I love that show. And the acting is brilliant. And more than the acting, every everything in the end, you know, it's, it's a surprise to the next episode. So uh, try watching How to Get Away with Murder. Then there is uh, Money Heist. I know a lot of you must be watching it. It's uh, number one on Netflix right now. Uh, this Spanish show, which is really, really nice. Um, it's all about never giving up and if you ever think that this is the end, it really isn't. So uh, watch that if you like uh, uh, if you like crime stories and thriller stuff, it's really nice. Then there is uh, American Crime Story, People vs. O.J. Simpson. That's also something that I really like. It's, uh, uh, it's about the death trial of O.J. Simpson. Uh, it's quite interesting. So if you get time, watch that. So these are like sort of my top five. Then there's also this movie called Seven, which has Brad Pitt, which is really nice. 
and I love Shutter Island also. So these are the basic top some stuff that I'm watching. Um, apart from that, uh, I'm still waiting for you guys to tell me if there's something really interesting that I can watch. I also love love stories. Uh, my favorite is actually uh, the proposal. Uh, which I love. I think it's my all-time favorite. I can watch it again and again. You've got me, which I really like. So, uh, <clears throat> tell me what you guys have been watching. I'm sure you guys have been watching because we have a lot of time on our hands. And that's the only way that, you know, we can keep ourselves busy. I mean, one of the only ways we can keep ourselves busy. Uh, so that, there are a lot of highs and there are a lot of hellos and there are a lot of hearts and kisses. <laughs> Oh, Chernobyl, yeah, I have seen Chernobyl. That's also a very interesting uh, show. Okay, Death Note. Okay, I'll, I'll try that. I haven't watched the uh, so on Amazon Prime. I haven't. I will watch that. Toli Bima. I have seen Toli Bima 11 times already, so I don't think I'll watch that again. Um, A Walk to Remember, yeah, it's also one of my favorites. Um, I've seen that. Veronica's horror movie, I've seen that. I have seen a lot of horror movies uh, also because I love horror as a genre. So, um, hi Priyanka. Hi Navya. So, there's so much of so many highs. Okay, guys, thank you for your uh, all the. References that you're asking me to watch, I will definitely uh, get my hands on that. And um, um, what have you been? What have you guys been doing? Um, really, apart from watching Netflix and stuff, because I have a lot of time, so I am doing a lot of stuff. I have started cooking a little bit, which I am doing. Um, my parents are very happy because I'm learning how to cook. <laughs> it's not major, amazing stuff that I can post pictures of yet, but maybe we'll get there. And um, what about, yeah, I've been reading a lot of stuff. Uh, I think some of you know that I'm a hardcore uh, reader, like I love reading. So there is this book that I have that I've been reading. It's called, this is the book. It's called Power of Intention by Dr. Wayne Dyer. He's this amazing, amazing guy who talks all about positivity. And I think right now we are um, surrounded by a lot of negativity around us. Uh, we are too much into the news. Guys, I'll just give you one suggestion. Please try and stay away from the news as much as possible. I mean, information is important, but over-information can just lead to a mental breakdown because there's too much of information. And um, I think we need to keep ourselves occupied in a way that keeps us positive. So the one way that I have been... Um, uh, keeping myself uh, positive is by reading this book, which is amazing. If you guys are not into reading, uh, there's also um, podcasts available online, which you can see and uh, you know, uh, hear. Yeah, you podcasts are to hear. So you can hear great stuff. There's also a lot of videos on YouTube uh, by Dr. Wayne Dyer. He talks about positivity, he talks about manifestations, he talks about meditation. And meditation is something that I've gone back to. I always wanted to do it, but I never took out the time. Uh, but now that I have all the time, I've started meditating. Somebody just asked me, <laughs> how can you make your skin glow? Okay, so this this actually uh, is covered the right time because, um, see, if you start meditating, you start glowing also. Trust me on that because it makes you really calm and peaceful and that reflects in the way you look also. So that's double benefit. Um, guys, meditation is not that difficult and it's... Um, you know, it's, it doesn't take an Einstein to understand it. You can go online. There are so many videos available on YouTube. Uh, for starters, there are guided meditations that you can start with. Trust me, it will change your life. I've also been doing a lot of yoga. So I think I have uh, become very flexible. And uh, I've also been working out. One thing I wanted to discuss with you guys is, uh, you are at home and you have time and I'm sure you are um, spending time with your family, I'm sure you are playing games with your family, the board games or you know, if, if you're staying with friends, that's brilliant, you have so much time to be with them, I'm sure you are making so much stuff, but uh, please take out at least half an hour to work out in the whole day because right now, having a good immunity is very, very important, like, 
immunity, uh, like a high level of immunity is really important. The only way we can get there is if we are working out and taking care of ourselves. So please, please uh, work out for a little bit. And you cannot say that, oh, we don't know how to do it, oh, but there's no trainer, oh, but there's no gym. You don't really need a gym to work out, honestly. Um, even if you don't have a mat, I'm sure you have carpets at home. You can always work out on carpets, trust me. And there is so much available on um, online. Okay, no, I, I don't play PUBG. <laughs> okay, coming back. Yeah, so, um, uh, yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, work out. So there are so many... Um, videos available online there's this um, fitness uh, thing on instagram which you can follow they uh, help you with workouts at home uh, i cannot stress that enough so um, please please focus on your fitness uh, focus on your health and don't give in completely don't be lazy um, i hope you're doing the things that keep you happy and positive and um, okay apart from that yeah, I also wanted to talk about this fact that as I started talking about meditation, I also wanted to tell you guys that it's very easy right now to sort of, you know, uh, lose your mental health because we are left to ourselves and we have all this time to ourselves and, you know, all these thoughts come back to us. Uh, the best way to actually um, uh, keep yourself um, positive is through meditation um, and talking to your friends. I FaceTime them a lot. I'm always FaceTiming them. <laughs> so uh, um, keep yourselves happy, guys. Keep yourselves busy. And uh, don't worry. We will overcome this also. Uh, let's not be negative And let's try and be positive. Also, um, uh, donations. Uh, I want to talk about donations also. Uh, there are some places where we can donate money. But if you don't want to donate uh, money or if you want to give only resources out like if you want to uh, um, if you can you can take care of a family around you I'm sure there are families around you which need your help right now I'm doing my bit in whatever way that is possible and I hope you are too because this is the time we need to help each other out so um, yeah please do that I mean help others around you this is the time uh, this is the time we need to be there for each other um, and what else um, I think this time has um, made me understand the value of a lot of things. I think for the first time I was looking at a plate full of food and I was looking and I was very, I was in gratitude. I was very happy uh, because a lot of people don't even have that right now. So I am in gratitude and um, I have amazing parents, I have an amazing family, I have amazing friends. And I hope you, you can find uh, things you are grateful for during this time. Um, I also want to thank our frontliners, the policemen who are working so hard, our doctors and nurses who are giving their all during this time. Um, I think they're doing a fabulous job and it's it's scary out there, but uh, we have to keep ourselves positive. So yeah, that's, that's all that I really wanted to say. There's so much that I've said already. <laughs> and uh, thank you for your suggestions that you have been giving to me to watch this stuff. I'll definitely go through that. And... Um, Hi Ranjit, you wanted me to say your name, so here it is. <laughs> okay, um, 